I stumbled upon some really fascinating research the other day there. In case you ever wondered why it was that dogs tend to circle around a few times before finally settling on a direction to, to do a poop. And now, there's been a lot of theories and some people believe that they're actually trampling the grass to make sure, uh, and chase away insects to make sure the area is clear. Uh, others believe they're surveying the, the, the landscape to make sure that it's safe before putting themselves in a potentially vulnerable situation. Some others believe they're stimulating their intestines. Now, all of these things could be true or could be true to a degree. But researchers in the Czech Republic and Germany, uh, Sean did some work that shone a slightly different light on, on the situation. And what they found is that in most cases, dogs tended to settle on, align themselves along the north-south axis. And, and it was a study of 70 dogs, 37 breeds, almost 2,000 poops, and they cross-referenced the final direction with the Earth's magnetic field activity at the time. And that's indeed what they found. They, they, most of the time, they aligned themselves along the north-south axis. And you're thinking, well, how do they even know? what that axis is. Well, it's instinctual and it's called magnetoreception. And it's not on, it's not just specific to dogs because many species of animal, fish, birds also use it. In fact, it's even, it's so common, it's called, it's referred to as the magnetic compass. In fact, whales and many species of birds will literally follow it. it, it in fact, talking about birds, so many birds have a, a, a magnetically sensitive mineral called magnetite in their brains, and even some have a chemical called cryptochrome that's magnetically sensitive in their retina that allows them to literally see the magnetic field just like we can see roads. In fact, scientists tested this by putting birds in a, a large hangar, and they, they observed them moving around in, direction, in the direction of the Earth's magnetic field, and then they abruptly changed it themselves. They, they just pressed a big switch to create a magnetic field. And as they changed it, the birds abruptly changed their direction to follow the new direction of, of, of the magnetic field. Isn't that absolutely fascinating? So it's called magnetoreception. So in, in case you ever wonder, they don't do it all of the time, but they do it a lot of the time. So there you go. In case, whenever you spot this kind of behaviour, you can, you can note to yourself that you now understand probably uh, what that what causes that. As I say, it might be a few other reasons as well, but that seems to be something that contributes heavily to the situation. There you go. Uh, have fun on your walks. <laughs>